from CareCo TV, one of the longest running outdoor programs on television today. Exploring the country and the coast in search of adventure. From the mountains of the great Northwest to the shores of the Atlantic Ocean, this is Americana Outdoors, presented by Garmin. This week on Americana Outdoors, it's the 2013 Ranger Cup University Challenge, a head-to-head -head matchup pitting University of Louisiana Monroe against Tennessee Tech on Jimmy Houston's private lake. We've caught over 70,000 fish out of this lake in 10 years, so, I mean, we recycle most of them, so there's a lot of them out there. You won't have any trouble catching a lot of fish, but uh, they tell you we fish everything barbless hooks. They break it on you yet? <laughs> That's the way they ought to fish all tournaments. Makes it fair for the fish, you know. Yeah, we have such an advantage over the fish nowadays. All the time, all the stuff we got. But uh, yeah, we smash the barbs down on everything. We fish everything barbless hooks. So, but if everybody's doing it, that makes it pretty even with the celebrity tournaments and everything we have here on that. We do it. We still do it all barbless hooks. We're here at Jimmy Houston's private lake with two top college fishing teams who have qualified to be here out of the Ranger Cup University program. This is an exciting program. We've got an exciting day in store for you. They're going to fish up to three sessions today. Each team that has a chance to win one point per session, once two points are, are earned in this event, the event is over. Our teams have qualified come from the University of Louisiana Monroe. They qualified out of the FLW series, and the other team came out of the Cabela's Collegiate Bass Fishing Series. That's the Tennessee Tech team. Both of these teams are powerhouse college fishing programs. Tennessee Tech almost won the national championship the last two years and the University of Louisiana Monroe is the current uh, school of the year team. What's going to happen out here on the water remains to be seen. We expect to see a lot of fish caught and the team that catches them wins session one will have a big advantage going into session two. I start the day off. Big enough, ain't it? That's Please fish man. number one for the University of Louisiana at Monroe. Tennessee Tech's Joe Slagle and Cliff Dye are also fishing on top. They've already put one keeper in the Ranger live well, and Joe has a hook in fish number two. That's a little better one. Number three. The problem with right now is it's so, in my opinion, this time of year is junk fishing anyways. But we're starting to figure out kind of where they are, especially if there, there seems to be a decent amount of fish in this creek that are eating. Less than 30 minutes into the first session, and Tennessee Tech has four in the boat. There's, there's a good one. Yeah, keep him on. <laughs> Okay, watch out, just watch out. Jazzy, hook it up. I got it. That's a little bit of fish right there. I ain't putting the ball on him if we get time. I get time, I get time. Well, with both teams on fish, we'll be right back with more from the 2013 Ranger Cup University Challenge. And later, we'll check in with Cabela's Bass Pro, Clark Wendlet. Garmin is the brand we trust. And if you're in the market for a new fish finder, we suggest you check out Garmin's complete line of Echo Fish Finders. Accurate, dependable, and affordable. It's the power of simple.
engineered to excel, the Ranger Z500 and Z100 series are built for the ultimate ownership experience. It's a commitment to excellence packed with real-world advantages and exclusive features. Experience the accelerated performance standards of the legendary Ranger Z series. From first light to last cast, they're put together to set you apart. Yamaha Outboards. Reliability starts here. Now, when it comes to wildlife management products and services related to raising big whitetails, you don't have to look any further than Mummies Incorporated. Located in South Texas, Mummies has been the leader in wildlife management products for over 20 years and know what products it takes to get the job done right. We're the largest independent dealer of Purina's Antler Max line of deer feeds. In addition to our famous brand of Mummies Deer Corn that's utilized on ranches all across South Texas. We have a wildlife specialist on staff to answer your deer management questions and help you out with your deer program. At Mummies, you're a part of the wildlife family and not just a customer. We try to be here for more than just some place to stop and pick up feed. We're here to answer anybody's questions and any kind of wildlife related instances. Before you make your next purchase of any wildlife-related items, be sure to check out our website at www.mummiesinc.com to see how we can help you out. For camping, fishing, hunting, or anything outdoors, bring along Arctic Ice. Simply freeze these versatile cooler packs and they're ready to keep your food and drinks cold throughout your outing. Arctic Ice can maintain in a cooler 60% longer than the equal weight of regular ice and with no more mess or soggy food. Arctic Ice is clean and easy. Alaskan series can maintain a sub 40 degree cooler for days and the Tundra series can keep game frozen until it gets home. Preserve an Arctic refuge in your cooler. Choose Arctic Ice. Americana Outdoors is brought to you by Garmin and the power of simple. Cabela's, the world's foremost outfitter. And by Frog Togs All Weather Gear. Welcome back to the 2013 Ranger Cup University Challenge, one of the most prestigious events in collegiate <laughs> bass fishing. It means a lot for our school because just getting here um, you had to compete against your Auburns, your, your uh, Texases, University of Texas, just schools with thousands of thousands of people. And, uh, and we, we're not a larger school, but we can, uh, it shows that ULM can compete. You know, the Ranger Cup University program is one of the many programs that are involved or have happened since college fishing has been created. Uh, this particular program is one of my favorites because it allows these collegiate anglers, whether they own a ranger boat or they don't, to be part of one of the largest contingency programs that you're going to find in competitive fishing. And we bring the winners from the FLW collegiate events and take them out and go out and compete with the winners of the Ranger Cup program on the Boat US side from the championship. And they come together, all expenses paid trip, and they come out here, they're treated like kings. Right now they're fishing Jimmy Houston's Lake. I mean, what better? type of an atmosphere can you can you ask for as a college angler for something that doesn't cost you anything. Number five. It's really a pretty cool format. I like I like the way it is for sure. Because it's not gonna be like somebody gets lucky and catches five in the morning and that's that's what it is. With Tennessee Tech sitting on a limit, we'll check in with Paul Clark and Brett Pruitt from the University of Louisiana at Monroe. They've put away the top water and are pitching soft plastics around the hardwood in around 14 feet of water. Oh, you hit that one. That's gonna, that's gonna help. Oh, I think. Yeah, baby. Come on in here with Papa. Oh my God, how many fish is over there? He's definitely bigger. There's, there's two, there's three fish with him, dude. What? There's four fish under the boat right now. <laughs> Quit fishing. Yeah, I can't fish now. There's too many fish. This one ain't gonna help, though. Hey, this one's smaller than that one. That ain't helping Dang. nothing, I don't think. We need a we need a six or seven pounder. Cause I know they're in here and it 
probably likely they the other guys might have one. With a limit on board, Slagle and Die continue what? to fish shallow. Oh, there he is. Hell, he jumped all the way out of the water for it. Sticking with a buzz bait and a square bill crankbait, they're catching fish, but they're not culling. Is that one bigger? No. It's a no. That one right there might go. Possibly. I doubt it, but. There's so much cover here that it's hard to narrow it down to one thing. Especially when you're catching fish almost every way you fish. Um, it's kind of like whichever one catches the biggest fish. It's kind of, you gotta just, I don't know, you just gotta go. There's not really any place to start. We caught them out on the main lake, we caught them back in the creeks. I guess our best luck has been back in the creeks, so. Just fish it back in and we'll just paddle back out. That one counted. That one counted Jimmy's rules. That one was in the boat. Add four pounds to our weight. If, uh, if you get a fish up by the boat and he gets off, it still counts as a catch. It doesn't count as a catch for y'all, probably, <laughs> on your weight, but, but it, we, as the, the numbers, we count as a catch. Everybody likes that rule, and, and you get somebody here like Larry Nixon or Roland Martin, one jumps off about 40 feet out there. They like to start counting it as a catch. But we don't do that. I tell them, I say, no, 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 he's got to get up close to the boat before you count it as a catch. No. Yeah. You mind the tree. Thumb and bark. Oh, right, right. Wait a minute, there's one just as big right here. Cluck and Pruitt have isolated a solid pattern, and they're culling with cool. almost every catch. Yeah. He might. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's the one we need. Come here, baby. Oh, come here, oh, baby. Oh, that's Come on, get him. Oh, I wish we had a net. Come on, baby. Get him over here, Paul. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, baby. Whoa! It's a slouch. Bam! Boom. Hook that. That's what we like about Jimmy Houston. Right there. <laughs> Give her a kiss. That was for you, Uncle Jimmy. Don't miss out on being part of the action. Signing up for the Ranger Cup University is free. All you have to do is fish and qualify. Visit rangerboats.com for the details. Coming up, we'll wrap up competition from the first session of the Ranger Cup University Challenge and head to weigh in. This season on Americana Outdoors, we're giving away a hunting or fishing trip of a lifetime. We're also giving away a stack of Cabela's gift cards and some great outdoor gear. All you have to do to win is go to the Americana Outdoors Facebook page and give us a like. It's that easy. The world has never seen a hook like this. What I thought was good before is not so good now. The first surgically sharpened fish hook. This is the best ever. In test after test, we have proven that anyone can set this new hook with half the effort of any other hook. That's money. Introducing the Trocar hook, a weapon for fishermen who aren't just out to catch fish, but are out to win. The Bubba Blade makes filleting fish faster, easier, and safer. Check this out. The Bubba Blade is super sharp and has a super grip. You can feel everything with this knife, it's really nice. One cut and you're through. Real smooth. It's just like butter. The Bubba Blade is the only fillet knife you're ever going to need. 
so check out our website at www.bubbablade.com and order your Bubba Blade today. Hobie's Mirage Drive kayaks set the standard for fun on the water. Whether your passion is fishing, sailing, or recreational adventure, Hobie's got a kayak for you. Hobie's Mirage Drive mimics nature's proven designs for efficient and powerful propulsion and enhances your kayaking experience. Mirage Power, Mirage Performance, Mirage Drive. Hobie, enjoy the ride. Americana Outdoors presented by Garmin is also brought to you by Power Pole Shallow Water Anchors, Big Bite Baits, bring the big bite to your line, and by Hobie Kayaks. Welcome back to Twin Eagle Ranch, the private getaway for bass fishing legend Jimmy Houston and the site of the 2013 Ranger Cup University Challenge. A head-to-head -head matchup featuring the University of Louisiana at Monroe against the Golden Eagles of Tennessee Tech. I think right now, probably maybe 15. I don't know how the other guys are doing, but I mean, I'm sure they're catching fish like we are, and they all seem to be twins right now. They're all two pounders, two and a half pounders. We really need to find a couple of of the fives and sixes that Jimmy was talking about earlier. I'm a little nervous. I'd say that we probably need about 18 pounds worth. Um, just uh, those guys are going to catch on. And we're trying to figure some stuff out. I think we're going to have to move out a little deeper. See if we can't catch a couple in this next period for sure. Probably flip a little bit more in these trees. Throw a jig. <laughs> I'd like to send a, a big shout out to Mr. Jimmy Houston for uh, providing this great lake and uh, opening up his house to us. And Ranger Boats supplies us with a great, uh, one of their new aluminum boats that they just came out with on that line. It's a great boat. They got a big deck on it for an aluminum boat, but they don't seem to be real heavy. Uh, they're great for getting in tight spaces and stumps and rocks and all. Ranger has been one of the longest supporters in college bass fishing. They, they came on board when this series first started and they have steadily grown their participation because they recognize that the future of college fishing and all of fishing is right here at this age class. This is a pretty unique event. You know, we, I get the opportunity with, with working for Ranger to, to visit a lot of different tournaments and this is, uh, this is really special because these guys, it's, you know, you, you've got just two teams involved, four guys that are getting, you know, what, what could be the opportunity of a lifetime. We're, you know, we're fortunate to be able to fish Jimmy Houston's lake today, and the thing is fantastic. It's, it's a beautiful setting, uh, and, you know, just from an overall experience standpoint, uh, you know, this, this is a really cool thing for, for a few college-age guys. How was it out there? Man, awesome. it, was, it was a blast. Wearing them out all Catch a lot of fish. I could hear you all over here. Now, it's pretty heavy. It's got to be nice. Yeah, they're good. pretty good. How many how many pounds think you got? Probably, Probably about 16, 16, 17. Let's see. You got more than that. I'm going to call it 20 pounds even. 20 even. 20 even right there on day one. I know people say this all the time about certain lakes, that they're the best fish they've ever been to. Well, this is hands down the best one I've ever been to. All right, what about y'all? Good day? We had, it was all right. We caught, we caught fish, plenty of they're, fish. They're all the same size. Yeah. Long way from Tennessee, but it's pretty neat <laughs> fish Jimmy Houston's lake. For yeah. sure, for Once sure. Once in a lifetime All right. I'm going to call it 12 pounds, two ounces, guys. We really thought we'd catch a lot more on top water this morning, but it just didn't work out that way, you know. I guess about 8.15 or 8.30, they started eating, and we caught a few on top water early, but it, it wasn't anything like we expected it to be. Join us next week, and we'll bring you the rest of the action from the 2013 Ranger Cup University Challenge. We'll also take an in-depth look at the new line of aluminum boats from Ranger Boats. In the meantime, take a look at them online at rangerboats.com. Everything we do on the water is powered by Yamaha Outboards. Look them up at yamahaoutboards.com. Coming up, we'll join Bass Pro Clark Wendlet for some advice on choosing the right fishing rod. 
Cabela's Tackle Box is your source for everything you need for a successful fishing trip. From rods and reels to the latest and premium tackle, shop online at cabelas.com. Well, we'll be right back with more from Americana Outdoors. Yamaha invites you to the Reliable Choice sales event. When you choose to cruise in reliable style, Yamaha is going to reward you with another choice, absolutely free. Purchase any new eligible Yamaha outboard and choose between a full five years of Yamaha limited warranty protection, or if you prefer, choose dealer credit up to $2,000 towards purchase of goods or services. Celebrate your freedom of choice with Yamaha reliability. This offer is only available for a limited time and it's all happening at your local Yamaha outboard dealers now. What if there was an action camera that went where you went, saw what you saw, and captured it more vividly than even your imagination? What if you could record video and shoot stills remotely? Would you keep your hands inside the vehicle at all times? Life, camera, action. The Verb HD Action Camera from Garmin. There is no other sunglass product on the market like Amphibia. Optimized for life on water and land, Amphibia frames are designed to fit comfortably no matter how your face is shaped, to stay firmly in place through your most physical activities and to float in water. See this? <sighs> no! Oh! I see them! On top of all this, Amphibia products are built to last, ensuring that they'll stand up to whatever you can dish out time and time again. No other sunglass product on the market offers the features and quality that we do. Amphibia Sports Sunglasses incorporates several new advances including maximum horizontal displacement lenses and a patented air cells that ensures every frame floats. In addition, Amphibia lenses are scratch resistant, 100% polarized, anti-reflective on both the inside and outside, water phobic and ANSI rated for protection. Amphibia sunglasses are truly designed for life on the water. It was the best day, 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 because of you. We make a great we pair. We make a great pair. Huh? Progressive. And the great outdoors. We make a great pair. Right. Totally. Uh, that's what I was thinking. Covering the things that make the outdoors great. Now that's progressive. Call or click today. Americana Outdoors presented by Garmin is also brought to you by Ranger Boats, still building legends one at a time. Yamaha Marine, reliability starts here. And by Bradley Smokers. Add some Bradley to your adventure. Welcome back to Americana Outdoors. Now with all the fishing gear on the market, choosing the right tackle can be a bit confusing for a novice angler. And when it comes to fishing rods, there are more choices than, well, you can shake a stick at if you know what I mean. So we have brought in three-time FLW Angler of the Year, Clark Wendlet, to help clear up some of the confusion. Oh, that's a nice little two-pounder. Cabela's American TXS. Really a new line for Cabela's. It's, uh, the sensitivity is there and these rods just, I mean, for me, it's absolutely perfect. This rod right here is medium heavy and it absolutely is exactly what you need. It just feels absolutely perfect. You know, the feel of the rod is really important. I'll let this fish go. You know, the feel of the rod's really important. The main things you're looking for is sensitivity in the rod. We got that covered. You know, Cabela's has, got, has come up with a graphite that's just really, really sensitive. But then after that, it's just the feel, the weight of the rod and the feel. And this one absolutely feels perfect to me, medium heavy. I'm winding a chatterbait right now, and so I'm winding it kind of slow. Conditions are kind of cold. All I'm basically doing is I want a rod that's gonna load up more back here in the back end of the rod but be a little bit more forgiving in the top. And, uh, and the medium heavy action is just perfect for that. Let's see if we can get another one. This Tournament ZX series 
is a technique specific series. And what it is, you, you know, it, you've got rods for crank baiting, you've got rods for topwaters and jerk baits, uh, jigs, swim baits. It's, it's a 10 rod series that kind of covers the whole gamut. And it doesn't necessarily mean you have to use a certain action for a certain technique, but it gives you a great starting point. That fish right there slammed the rod. And I want to show you what a rod can do for you on a fish. You look inside that fish's mouth and look how far that bait is in there. It didn't catch him on the edge of the mouth. It caught him way down in there. And the reason is, is that I had the right action rod. What have, when, I, when I got that bite, when I felt that bite, that fish inhaled that bait, my rod's just a little bit slow. And when I say slow, you want a little bit of a slower rod on a winding bait. I'm winding a chatterbait. It allowed him to suck it all the way in, and I had the backbone to set the hook. Wow, great fish. There's one. First cast with a crankbait. A nice one, too. And I had several bites on a chatterbait and I started thinking, gosh, a crankbait would be way better. I sat down, tied on a crankbait and first cast literally with it. Boom. Oh, that's another nice one. Definitely got a little school of them right there. Sucker is fat. That's pretty awesome right there. You know, the rod means so much on cranking. What you gotta have is, a lot of these crankbaits are light, and so you gotta have a rod that basically lets you cast well, so it's gotta have some tip to it. You also have a tendency when you're cranking to pull a, a bait away from a fish. A fish can't get that bait. It actually, you know, it actually bites it. He's, he's basically inhaling the bait, chomping down on it. You pull it away from him if you have too stiff a rod, so you need something fairly limber. Wow, that's the first cast of that. Let's get, get us another one. If you're in the market for some new gear, give the Cabela's Platinum ZX casting rod a look. It's also available as a spinning rod. Match it up with the Cabela's Tournament ZX Reel for that perfect set. Shop online at cabelas.com. Oh, and while you're online, visit the Americana Outdoors Facebook page and register to win one of our big giveaways, like an all-expense-paid hunting trip or fishing trip. To register, all you need to do is give us a like. We're drawing winners soon, so register today. Hey, and if you have a photo from your latest fishing trip or hunt, we encourage you to post that up on our page. We'd love to see it. Americana Outdoors is a CareCo TV production. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.